Yo guys, Code Life here. So in today's video guys, I'm going to be quickly explaining everything you need to know about the new aim training map that Mongrel himself plays on a daily basis and actually recommends all of you play it as well. Bro, this... Oh. I recommend you play this map so much chat. Like, this is so fun to do this. It's so fun. I could do this for hours, I'm not even trolling. As you heard right there guys, one of the best aimers in Fortnite recommended you all play on this map and that's why today I just had to do a video on it to let you all know about it. And yeah, jumping straight into the video guys, I'll firstly be explaining what Mongrel does on this map, aka his normal aim training routine, and then I'll go ahead and show you all how to play it for yourselves. So for Mongrel's routine on this map, it actually varies quite a bit because of the amount of scenarios there are to choose from to practice your aim with. Currently, there are four different scenarios for each aim training style. There's Tile Frenzy, there's Tracking, and there's Flick Shots. Out of all of these that I just listed right there, Mongrel has a select few that he tends to play on on a regular basis. He does still like to play on all of them as he likes to cycle through slash rotate through them. But again, like I just mentioned, he does have a select few favourites that he really does enjoy and I'll list those right now. So his favourites for Tile Frenzy are Moving Targets and Jumbo. For Tracking, he really likes Skeet, RNG and Horizontal. And for Flick Shots, Mongrel really enjoys playing Popcorn and Tito Bounce. And those six different scenarios right there are the scenarios that Mongrel likes to practice on before he does jump into a game on a daily basis. Usually, Mongrel likes to spend a total of 15 to 30 minutes cycling through all of these six different scenarios, but sometimes you will see him rotate in some of the other scenarios that I didn't mention that weren't his favourites also as well. Like I mentioned though, usually you can see him spend around 15 to 30 minutes on this map. Though saying that, I have seen him spend as little as 5 minutes on this map before and as long as 1 hour on it. So really it does depend on the day and what Mongrel is feeling. Some days his aim might feel really off and he needs to spend more time on practicing it. And some days his aim might feel on point and he only has to spend very little time. It does all depend on the day. When Mongrel is doing his full warm-up routine though guys, he'll usually spend around 2 to 10 minutes on each individual scenario. I wish I could give you guys the exact time he spends on each scenario, but he does change it up quite a lot. And that's actually something that I recommend you guys do as well. As really the point of doing this is if Mongrel does feel like his tracking is off, what he'll do is he'll spend more time on the tracking scenario than he does on any of the others, like say Flick Shots for example. But yeah, that's the scenarios that Mongrel does play on this map. And quickly, while we are on the topic of Mongrel's warm-up and his sort of routines, I want to quickly recommend this video right here, where I did a full breakdown of Mongrel's actual warm-up routine, the one he does before he jumps into a Fortnite game every Every day. It's super in depth guys and worth checking out so if that does interest you I'll leave a link to it in the description below. Moving back over to Mongrel's aim training though, now that I've showed you guys exactly what he does, let me now show you all how to play this map for yourselves so that all of you watching can grind it out and get your aim as good as Mongrel's. So, the first thing you guys want to do to play this map for yourselves is jump into a creative server. Once you've loaded into a creative server, you want to head over to a portal and enter in the map code. The map that Mongrel plays is called the Skavok Aim Trainer. And the map code for it is 8022-6842-4965. And I'll put that code in the description below so you guys can literally just copy and paste it in. And yeah, after you guys have entered in the map code, you then want to jump into the portal and it'll teleport you straight into the map where you're now good to practice your aim. It's as easy as that, guys. But yeah, that's the map right there. I would show you guys how to play it, but honestly, Don Wazzy, the very talented map creator, has already done that for me. He's made this new updated version of his map super simple and easy to navigate. Like literally every single scenario is right there in front of you. All you need to do is grab a gun, shoot the scenario you'd like to play, and boom, you're good to go. If you want to back out of a certain scenario, it's super easy. All you need to do is shoot that big back to lobby button and boom you'll return back to the lobby. It's very very easy to navigate through all of this map guys as the button placements are all consistent throughout. I definitely recommend that all of you guys watching this video right now do at least try this map out for yourselves. If you like it that's great guys you can literally do what Mongrel does and grind this from 15 minutes to 30 minutes or whatever routine suits you. Like even if you guys do play it as little as five minutes before you play Fortnite each 
each day, I can guarantee right now that your aim will improve. All of these scenarios have been designed to help you guys out, and I can promise you all right now that you will improve. Like even Mongrel himself recommended it guys, as I showed you in the beginning, and he's not even the only pro that recommends it slash plays it. There's a bunch of other pro players that have played this map or have played the older version. That's players like Tfue, Zexro, the controller player Innocent, and many many more. All of those pros grind this map daily guys, or at least play it a few minutes a day. So if that being the case, and because the pros do it, it's something that you guys might want to consider doing as well. In my opinion guys, if your aim is lacking, this will definitely help you improve it. And yeah, that's all for me today guys. I really do hope this map does help you all get godlike aim, like Mongrel does. But remember guys, that practice does make perfect, so you are going to have to put the time in to get the results that you do want. And yeah, that's all for me today guys. Thank you all so much for watching. Hope you all have a great day. Peace.